Perks, Jared Marshman says one thing he's afraid of is spiders, but that might be the only thing that can slow down this 6-1 right-hander. Steve Lloyd explains what makes him the reigning PSAC pitcher of the year and why he's so dominant. It wasn't Jared Marshman's day Friday afternoon facing the 15th ranked Millersville Marauders baseball team. The Bloomsburg Huskies graduate senior only pitched five innings, allowing 10 hits and five earned runs in the loss. But this hasn't been the case the last two seasons for the former Berwick Bulldog. Marshman has been dominant, piling up 15 wins and 120 innings of work, also setting new program records for wins, now 25, and career strikeouts with 226 punchouts. It's amazing. It's, it was, it's honestly life-changing. Um, I actually I wasn't really interested in Bloom or looked at before. Like I think I committed here April of my senior year of high school, and I'm, I'm glad I did. It's honestly been the best uh, decision I've ever made. They really elevated us. Um, Marsh, you know, leading the charge, but we, it's a special group of seniors that have done tremendous things, and uh, I'll you know always be indebted to these guys for what they did on and off the field academically and in our community, and um, really kind of set a standard for our program. Well, Jared wasn't always a dominant pitcher here at Bloomsburg. He struggled in his first two years on the mound for the Huskies, but come his junior year that's when he really got things rolling his freshman year we used him out of the bullpen in kind of a crazy seven hour 18 inning game against Mercyhurst in the NCAA regional and he pitched his brains out we ended up losing the game but it was an unbelievable performance out of the bullpen Marshman isn't the only pitcher from District 2 on the staff Nate Baranski from Wyoming Valley West Scott Gilbert from Abington Heights and Cole Coolball from Wyoming area round out Collins rotation there's a great thing going right here right now. If you want to compete for PSAC title every year, you should come here. Steve Lloyd, Newswatch 16 Sports, Columbia County.